The showdown between Alley Sal and Soledad High School pit two teams looking to notch their first win in the season. The question was, who would lead with that win at the end of the night? The Trojans would get the scoring started first with a one-yard touchdown run by Israel Corona to give Alley Sal a 7-0 lead. Early in the second quarter, the Trojans would add a field goal to extend their lead to 10-0 over Soledad. Alley Sal quarterback Andrew Marquez would then make it a 17-0 lead with his 80-yard touchdown run. The Soledad offense started to show some life as quarterback Robbie Santa Ana finds wide receiver Angel Olivas down the right sideline for a 65-yard touchdown pass to trim the deficit to 17-7 in the first half. Soledad would be searching for more points at the end of the half, but Ali Sal's Michael Morris put a stop to that with this nice interception as the Trojans went into the locker room up 17-7. In the second half, Soledad clawed back into the game with an Emmanuel Ortega touchdown run in the third quarter, followed by a field goal with 5.48 left in the fourth to tie the game at 17-all. The Aztecs would get the ball again, and with second and goal from the 14, Santa Ana and Olivas would connect for their second touchdown with 24 seconds left and eventual 24-17 victory. Afterward, Olivas said they knew what needed to be done to secure the win. Oh, we, we just made that play up, man. As, as me, as you always get open. Ali Sal head coach Cesar Chidas said he was proud of the way his team played in the face of adversity, and now it's time to learn from this game to prepare for next week's matchup against North Salinas. Well, we keep working hard. We go back and we regroup. Obviously, continue doing what we're doing as far as studying film, getting our kids prepared for the next game. And it's, you know, just like in the football field, it's a next play mentality. Now it's a next next game. We got North High. So now we got to focus on them and obviously do everything in our power to, to ensure that our kids are as prepared as they can be. Soledad head coach Frankie Berlanga said Ali Sal gave the Aztecs a tough game. I saw competing very well tonight. Put up a great, a great, a great lead on us. I know we weren't playing to the best of our abilities, so we just uh, did our best to make adjustments at, at the half, and we came out executing the way we thought we could and the way we should have. Um, but hats off to Alice; they completed very, very well, put us into very, very difficult positions and situations in, in the game. But uh, so I can be be more proud of our guys with that comeback victory. With Soledad's first win behind them, Berlanga knows it doesn't get easier from here as the Greenfield Bruins await for them next week. It's our rival. We know they we know they want to beat us really bad. So we do everything we can to prepare to make sure that we just continue to play play our style of football and continue to have the just the, the outcome in our favor. For the Salinas Californian Sports, this is Quinn Robinson.